Is a tiny house good for older people? This is a great question. And actually, I really like this question because absolutely, uh, tiny houses are good for everybody, pretty much. There's a couple of drawbacks here and there, but for the most part, a tiny house can be made for anybody. Um, good for older people, for sure. We live in the north. Uh, our lakes freeze over in the winter time, so we have a lot of ice fish houses. And if you've never seen an ice, ice house or an ice shanty, uh, check them out online. What happens with ice houses is the wheels uh, lift up so then the whole house sits down on the ground and we can build it that way for older people. So if, if you're trying to get something for somebody who, who needs a main floor bedroom and needs it to be like uh, wheelchair accessible or really easy to get into, we can actually build it so the, uh, so the axles will drop, uh, flip up, the house drops down and then maybe there's a little ramp or something to get into, that, uh, into the door and make it really easy for them. Uh, house, uh, tiny houses are fairly inexpensive. I mean, you know, sixty, seventy, eighty thousand dollars to get into one, depending on the size and the structure and how how everything works. But you know, if you have an older parent, maybe that uh, needs to go into a, a an assisted living or some kind of you know st structured facility, and those things are like five, six, eight, ten thousand dollars a month, whatever they're going to be. Um, a tiny house for sixty thousand dollars is going to be a much better bet because you know that this person is going to be better cared for at home. It's going to have more family interaction. They're, they're going to be able to be entertained. They're going to be with uh, grandkids or, or the rest of the family and stuff like that. So if you do a tiny house in the backyard, that's going to be so much more beneficial for that person than just sending them off somewhere uh, where you might not be able to visit them very often. They won't get that interaction from, from fr friends and family. So. I think that's a great, great option. There's also, you know, older people who just want to downsize. They're they're ready for something new or something smaller, and and a tiny house definitely can accommodate that. It's infinitely uh, designable. I mean, you can do whatever you want to with it. So if you need a main floor bedroom, if you're not interested in the loft, if you want just a kitchenette, if you want a bathroom, no bathroom. I I mean, there's no there's no real right or wrong anything to it. Um, it's it's going to be designed around you. So. To answer this specific question, absolutely. Good for older people.